Hello everybody, my name is Gloria Linda Diaz and today we're going to be talking about the Sesh Evos. I got them in this red, deep red color. I really liked them. I really wanted to try them out. And I'm going to give you my honest thoughts and opinions. This is a little bit of how the box looks like. And um, let's get straight into the video. Okay, everybody, this is going to be an unboxing of the Skull Candy Truly Wireless Perfectly Simple Sesh Evo Buds. And um, let's open it up. It comes with a little sticker right here. I, had, I already took it off, but I haven't checked what's inside yet. So let's see. I got them in this red, maroon, whatever you want to call it, color, because it was on sale on Amazon. It's on sale right now, this, the Sesh Evos um, for um, $29.99, um, and it comes out of the box, straight out of the box. You get your earbuds in your case, you get, I don't know what this is put that aside you will get your user guide in this little plastic baggie let's just pull that on out of there you will get let's see what type of cable it is USB A to USB C so that's a plus it's USB C and you will get extra tips ear tips so I'm guessing these are the small ones and the ones that are and the large ones and the ones that are in there right now are probably the medium. So this is how they look like. They are red which is good just like the case and the earbuds. And here is the case. It says Skull Candy and it has four indicator lights. Okay. Um, in the back, there's the USB C. Um, and um, let's open it up. You open it up. These are the magnets. And that is where you're going to place the earbuds. And it is already about 75% charged. Let's take a look at these earbuds. They are tightly snug in there. Okay, these are the earbuds. And I think this red finish looks really nice. This deep red, I believe that's what it's called. And one of the things I like about uh, certain earbuds is not just touch controls, but push controls. I don't know if you can hear that. Let's see. Let's see where the mic is. These are actually uh, you press the button. You just press right where the skull is. And they seem, I'm going to put these in my ear and do a fit test and see how the mediums fit, um, standard size fit, and how I'm gonna show you how they look like. But before I do that, I'm gonna show you the user guide. So this is the Sesh Evos, okay, auto pairing mode, auto power on, I guess when you take them out, this is how it looks like, auto power off, I guess when you set them in there, charging the earbuds. So it comes with a big, a lot of touch controls. And to find it with tile, because 
uh, this is uh, supported by the Tile app. If you lose them, you can find them with the Tile app, just like it says on the box. It says built-in tile. So uh, if y'all don't know what that is, uh, oh, it also came with this. It is the control sheet. Oh, so in case if you need to keep it around, um, it'll say left earbud, right earbud, and show you all the controls. And it it says do this first. It says remove earbuds from package, place them in the charging case, make sure, sure both earbud LED turn red. Let's do that. Let's see if they do that. That turned red. And that turned red. So, okay. And then it says, number two, remove earbuds from charging cases will automatically put them in pairing mode. Okay. Open the list of Bluetooth devices and select Sesh Evo. So they're going to register as Sesh Evo. Earbud LEDs will turn blue when connected. Be sure to select pair if you see the Bluetooth pairing request. Okay, guys. So you're going to need to read this little piece of cardboard paper that they put in there and it's probably going to be uh, smart to keep it okay everybody we are going to be doing the fit test um i haven't paired them to my phone yet so I, i'll show you the mic quality in a bit but i'm going to open the case they still have that red this is how it snaps still have that red indicator light which indicates to me that it's charging. Um, I'm gonna put it in my ear and show you how they fit and how you would put them on. So you stick that in your ear and I'll let you know if it's a comfortable fit or not. So this is how they would look. Now, they don't really stand out, in my opinion, like pop out, um, at least I don't think so. It doesn't look like it, but let's do the shake test. They seem to stay put in there very well. And right now it says pairing, but it's looking for my device, but um, I heard that in both earbuds, but uh, I haven't paired it yet. Um, I'm going to t test out the sound quality, the music quality. It has three modes. Uh, it has a movie mode. It has, uh, it says it has, we're in the back here, it says, I saw it somewhere movie mode music mode and podcast mode so I'm going to test those out okay guys so I am going to pair these to my Apple iPhone um, and see how it works if it says it works as easily as it says so I'm gonna go to my settings open up my Bluetooth and I going to open up now that indicator light is 50%. So I'm pretty sure they're charged a little. Um, and I'm gonna put them on. And I'm gonna press this button because I think this is the pairing button. It says pairing Sesh Evo. 
connected. So it says it's connected. So that is great. Okay guys, I tested the Sesh Evos out. Um, and they were, they are budget pair of earphones. They are going to run you $30. Um, they are charging right now. Um, let me give you my thoughts. They don't go very loud. And that is a very big con for me. The bass really wasn't there. And I'm surprised because I own the Skull Candy Dimes and they go louder, in my opinion, than these do. And um, I was raising the volume and I was like, is that it? Like, is that all it goes? So um, I like Skull Candy. I love this red finished case. Um, however, it is not wireless charging, it's USB-C only, but it's USB-C and it's, it's $29.99 on Amazon right now. So what do you expect? Um, the controls, there is a lot of them, but you can get used to them. They were very responsive and uh, I like the fact, the pros for me is that it is a push button control. Um, I just don't like the sound experience in either mo of the modes, in movie mode, podcast mode, and especially music mode where I'm going to be using it probably the most when I go for my long runs. So I would give these on a scale of 1 to 10, I would give them a 4. They look great. The case is great. The case actually doesn't feel cheap to me. Um, the earbuds themselves don't feel cheap to me. Um, I just wish they had a little bit better sound to offer. And I'm telling you this, guys, just in case you were thinking about picking up a pair. Maybe you already own a pair. Let me know what you think about yours. Maybe your opinion is completely different than mine. But they just didn't do it on the sound quality for me. They didn't do it on uh, performance. So I am going to have to say no to the Sesh Evos. Um, m if you don't like your music that loud and if you just want to hear music and just really want to buy a, a decent pair of headphones for $29.99, then go ahead and get them if you really want to get them. But I'm just letting you know now that the sound doesn't go very loud and, um, but they are pretty. <laughs> um, that's the only pro I could say about them, but, um, this is all my opinion, my review and something I wanted to share with you. And so thank you for watching my videos, guys. Like and subscribe. Um, I appreciate every subscriber, every comment, every like. And I will see you guys next time. Mic test one, two. Mic test one, two. This is how you will sound using these earbuds. And I wanted to give you a quick mic test. I'm out.